again, what you eat matters. You have to be watching what's going in your mouth. You have to. One of my big do nots, and there's a lot of times I don't tell people don't do anything, but this is one of the big do nots. Do not in any form get NutraSweet into your body. Okay? NutraSweet is um, it's the number one complaint to the FDA on food related uh, reactivity. Um, it was originally refused the market because of brain cancer studies. Um, it was repurposed a couple of years later. The, the brain cancer studies were removed and ended up getting on the market. It is a massive thing. It is everywhere. There is a lot of issues with it. Okay? Um, it is a neurotoxin. Um, when we really get to, uh, down to the, the looking at the chemical process of neurotoxin. The other big deal with it is uh, one of the byproducts that it breaks down into as, it, it, as it's metabolized in your body is formaldehyde. Okay, from now we know is preservative. It's a carcinogen, known carcinogen. Um, and uh, especially when it's, when it's heated, um, that byproduct is produced more readily. So people are putting NutraSweet into coffees and those types of things. Um, and with it, a little bit is not okay. Okay, because people say, well, I just, I mean, I only use just a little bit of okay. My announcer give everyone, because mm -hmm. I'm going to make everyone brownies. Okay, I'm going to make you guys some brownies. And I'm going to put just a little bit of dot food down. Just a little bit. <laughs> Probably won't even taste this there. I mean, I'll tell you, I'll probably tell you it's there, but just a little bit. Won't even taste it, it'll be fine. You guys can just eat that. And people go, that's disgusting, I'll never eat that. A little bit of anything that's bad matters. You know what I'm saying? Um, do you, either of you guys have used uh, gum, mints, any of those types of things? Uh, okay. Don't. Okay, anything you see at the checkout counter, all of that stuff, if you if you look at the side of that, I really need to bring a package. Remind me to bring a package of that stuff with me. Um, but you'll see a little warning on the side that says fetal keto yurts contains phenylalanine. That is your red flag for NutraSweet. They'll always, they have to have the warning on there um, because it can really cause some serious problems otherwise. Um, so you just need to make sure you read the label. Don't ever do that. Don't give it to your kids. Make sure it's not in your mint, your gums, those types of things at all. I mean, I will animately look at stuff. Anything of your drinks, um, you know, anything that's on the shelves, nowhere. The other big one with that is sucralose. Sucralose is the other huge one that you don't want is because and that's really common in like your sports drinks, energy drinks, um, some of the, the the iced teas and those types of things. Uh, they'll have super they're sweet and sucralose. Mm -hmm. That's another huge one that you do not want to get in your in yourself at all. A flat out will not. I'll refuse anything that has it in it at all. Um, I have I still carry a little yellow packet in my drawer from one of my patients from years ago. Um, she started a downward spiral that was horrible to watch. And I mean, she was coming to my office on a regular basis. I knew all my checks. Physical came up emotionally over and over and over. I and mean, asking all these questions and she just continued to deteriorate, spending thousands of dollars on her health and just watching this lady fall apart. Um, and I kept asking her every time she was in, anything, nothing you touch, taste, smell, anything different. You know, physical, chemical emotion, nothing, nothing, nothing. And one week she finally came and she's the only thing that I can think of is I started using this in my tea. And she held up the little yellow packet. And I said, stop immediately. And within a week, she turned around and she had a, she had a full recovery. And it was because of her body's response to super loss. And super loss is Splenda. Splenda. That's fine. Yeah, that, okay. is the, that is the, the general so name. Yeah, but, yeah, but super loss is not all Splenda. So I think it is now super loss is in other forms as well, not just Splenda. Okay. Don't quote me on that yet, but I'm pretty sure there is. Okay. But you almost always see it. Super close if it's on a, on a, a label. Right. So look for that stuff. Like I said, you want to reduce any load of chemical stress, especially in pregnancy and then post. Anything you can reduce to have those going into you, you're going to be healthier for that. Um, we talked about drinking water treatment.